Yeah, we're going back to December, I had a very impressive performance then. Talk to me about that victory and just how much it meant for you to, to get a win after the losses. Well, I feel, you know, uh, in my last fight, I feel like so great, like get that W, you know, the, the great, uh, get that win. But I'm still excited for this fight. <laughs> nice. And then, of course, you were supposed to come back earlier this year, but you had the weight miss. Uh, hadn't had a chance to speak to you since then. So just tell us what happened. Well, I fight almost for two years, so one year and a half in 155. And when I, I tried to drop to 145, it was super hard. And one week, two weeks before to get my fight, I, uh, I was sick. I, uh, like, like, uh, I'm thinking like it was COVID, but not. <laughs> and you know, when, when you get sick, it, like, it's hard to drop in weight, right? Um, you know, like UFC and, and, and the, the matchmaker, uh, everyone uh, knew that. But, well, I, and I say like, oh, okay, I want, I want to try to do my best, right? Like, try to, to drop to 146. <laughs> uh, and, but, but I speak before, like two or three weeks before, like, hey, if I can drop, we can, we can do a catch weight. And, and in the beginning, it was say, uh, the, the other guy said no, but that day he said yes, and he stepped in the scale 146. And, you know, uh, this, these things happen a lot. I was going to ask, I mean, obviously it's your job to make weight, but we don't see very often where the other fighter says, okay, I'm not fighting. So what did you think? I mean, I guess you're wrong, so you ha it's your fault in a way, but were you upset that he didn't take the fight? Well, I know it's my mistake because I, don't, I, I miss weight. In, in, I'm a professional, right? I need to make weight. But I was, yeah, I was mad. I was angry because he, before he said yes, Everything it was like the, the the fight goes on, you know, but after that, it, he say I don't know, I don't know what happened. He's I don't know. He he think like he 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 did not he not his best choice for his career. I don't know, you know, like every every head is a, is a war. So uh, we know that you had the illness and everything, but was there any talk of hey, let's just stay at lightweight, or did you feel comfortable immediately saying no, I'm a I'm a featherweight? No, I want to fight in both in both, both weight class. I want to, but my, my main, I want to fight in 145. Okay, that's my main. And if someone like, you know, like like they always uh, drop fights, drop um, drop fights. Yeah. Hey, they they, they can say like, hey, Mowgli, I have this this opening in 155. You want to take it? Of course. It's it's, it's about this, right? <laughs> Nice. Did you have to talk to the UFC about you know about staying at featherweight? Were they concerned at all, or did they have no? They, they know. They know. I want to fight in 145 and 155. Right. Both guys. So this week, no no issue at all. No, I'm ready. Nice. Talk about the matchup. What do you think about uh, Billy as an opponent? What, what do you think about the fight? I know it's a tough uh, tough uh, opponent, and it's gonna be a fun uh, fun fight to watch. Very nice. And I guess is there, I mean, is the goal just victory or do you feel like, you know, you need to make a statement or prove to people anything? What's, what's the goal here? My goal is get that win. That's it. <laughs> Hi. Hi. So this fight isn't exactly short notice, but it, what, you weren't the original opponent. Um, do you feel like this is a little bit rushed for you or do you feel like you had enough time? I feel good. I feel great because, you know, like in, in my last uh, fight, I prepared for everything. Like even this fight, I prepared, I prepared for everything and I'm ready to go. So was this opponent somebody that you had your eye on or, or when this matchup came up, um, was it just a new idea for you or was he somebody that you wanted to fight? Uh, like what? Was he somebody that you had your eyes on? Is it an opponent that you had wanted to fight at some point? No, like like everyone say like he's a good opponent because he he always go forward like like my kind of my 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 style, but I know he want he go he's better in the ground you know like it is good for both. Thank you. Right over here, um, Mowgli, obviously from Mexico. Mexico finally has their first UFC champion. What was it like for you to watch Brendan Moreno win? Well, like not like me, like everyone that is Mexican, they feel like super proud about him. Yeah. What did you think of Irena Aldana's performance a couple of days ago with the knockout? She's really strong <laughs> for that weight class. And 
she's good. She do uh, his uh, strategy like very well because I see like couple um, videos like when she started doing the, uh, the warm up, he throw the same hook and you know like everything's like work. Thank you. You're welcome. Cool. Awesome. Thanks, sir.